you have your new read at home, this is the first time out of the box. There are a couple of processes that you can do to a brand new read, which will make it play better before you've even soaked it for the very first time. The first one of those things is buffing the dry reed blade. Gently hold your reed, supporting it with your non-dominant hand. If you're right-handed, take the corner of a piece of sandpaper, and this will be a very fine grit, 400 or 600, and begin by very, very gently sanding the very rail of the blade. You can see this is a very small amount of cane that's coming off. Do the other rail on the other side. You can actually do a little bit right in front of your first wire. And you can do the corners like that. And one very important place to avoid, imagine drawing a circle right behind the tip of the blade, two millimeters down from the end. If you imagine a circle right below the tip, never ever touch that area of your reed and it will be much happier and so will you. One more process that you can do while the reed is still dry, so this is before its first soaking, is you can give it a very gentle chisel tip. This is something that's done to increase the response of the reed when you articulate the end, and it feels a little bit better in the mouth to have a chisel tip rather than a blunt tip. To do this, put your fine grit sandpaper on a sturdy, flat surface, very gently, at about a 20 degree angle, very gently, Pull the reed backwards with very light pressure on the very tip of the reed blade. About five gentle times is all that you need on each blade, and you can see there's a very, very fine amount of dust on this dark piece of waterproof sandpaper. Repeat the buffing and the chisel tip on the other blade. After you've buffed your reed blades and you've created a chisel tip at the end of each blade, you're ready to soak your reed up for the first time. Please see the other video for the length of time suggested for you and your area. When you have soaked your reed, take careful note of the tip opening. If the tip opening has expanded to become the shape of a football, all you need to do is just gently pinch the first wire with your thumb and forefinger until you have the tip opening that you want. Then you're ready to put it on your bassoon and try it out.